Welcome back to The Price of Business. I'm your host, Kevin Price, talking to you about you and your business. You know, it's your business to really be uh, smart when it comes to uh, handling your money and all of your resources and, and really uh, trying to make sure you're uh, taking care of your bottom line. That's why we have Thomas Pepe as a contributor. He's a regular contributor here on The Price of Business. And uh, he's got a great uh, company called, uh, in fact, he, he's, he works with two firms. But today we're going to focus a little bit on Save, Love, Give. Uh, which is extremely consumer friendly, and uh, he's got a great guest for us today. And as always, Tom, gl- glad to have you on. Why don't you do your, um, you know, basically your elevator speech, and then introduce your guest today and welcome. Hey, welcome, Kevin. Thanks for having me again, um, as always. So today, um, I have Mary Newman of the Sudden Cardiac Arrest Foundation, and she's going to be, and her foundation is going to be a featured partner on our Save Love Give platform. And really quickly, just to explain that. Um, Save Love Give is a website where you visit, you a- it analyzes your wireless bill, and then it allows you to, um, by cho- your choice, to donate it to a-, a cause that you feel worthy of. And, and like I said, Mary is our featured partner, and I'll let her explain uh, all about her foundation. Welcome to the show, Mary. Go right ahead. Thank you. Thank you, Kevin. Thank you, Tom. It's um, a great um, honor to be able to join you on your show today. Um, the Sudden Cardiac Arrest Foundation is a national nonprofit organization uh, whose mission is to raise awareness about sudden cardiac arrest, which um, many people do not um, are not aware of, but it's the leading cause of death in the U.S. It affects about a thousand people every day. Most of those victims do not survive um, because they are not treated quickly enough with CPR and defibrillators. But those who are treated quickly have a fairly good um, chance of survival. So our mission is to raise public awareness about this uh, condition and the things that anybody can do to help save a life. Okay. How, how old is the foundation? Kind of give us a little bit of the history of it. It was founded in 2006. Wow, relatively so new. Yeah, go ahead, Thomas. Yeah, no, I, our challenge is always, you know, distribution and, and wireless touches every single life in the country and globally. And, and we think that by having featured partners, we can outreach to uh, different organizations and, and grab people that they're passionate about. And, and that's why we, we like to have um, guests or featured partners like Mary on yeah. the platform. Awesome. So uh, tell us how, uh, you know, tell us a little bit about how you get your, your word out, Mary. Well, we have, um, we have a very uh, comprehensive website that is focused strictly on sudden cardiac arrest and it, it includes not only news and educational campaigns that we've developed, um, we have one that go, is targeted to secondary schools and another one that's targeted to colleges, um, but we also have an online survivor network. Um, as I mentioned, survival rates are generally low, um, but there is a growing, thankfully there is a growing um, community of people who do survive cardiac arrest. and. Once they survive, often there are issues that they need to address some of the psycho, uh, psychosocial issues that are they're faced with afterwards, and it's always helpful for them to speak with other survivors, so we connect them um, through that mechanism. And eventually, most survivors want to get involved in the cause and help spread the word. They figure that they're, they were saved for a reason, um, and they have a new, renewed purpose in their life. So... We um, have information on our website. We have these educational campaigns. We often work with the media on on this topic, um, try to raise awareness in those ways. All right. Talking about a uh, very important organization out there, uh, an organization that's really helping uh, individuals with one of the biggest problems that Americans have, uh, sudden, sudden cardiac arrest. It's a major health issue, and uh, it's a sudden, sudden cardiac arrest foundation. By the way, that's sca-aware.org, sca-aware.org. Thomas, you talked about them being featured. You feature many uh, nonprofits uh, through your work at Save, Love, Give. What does that exactly mean? So for, the, for the, uh, a given period of time, we'll feature uh, a foundation uh, such as Mary's or like Mary's, and all of the um, transactions that we get through our website um, nationally, we present the message uh, of the, about her foundation after the clients uh, see their savings or get their bill, at, bill analyzed. 
Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. And so, uh, yeah, it's a great opportunity to, you know, basically save money and at the same time help a nonprofit. Yeah, I mean, our value proposition is very simple. We, we, present, um, we present our customers with um, the opportunity to give after we've done something for them, after they we've, we found money. So we're not just saying give. We say, you know, here's, you've saved something. Now maybe you want to do something better with that. Yeah, for all those people who think you can't have your cake and eat it too, they need to check out Save, yeah. Love, Give, because that's <laughs> yeah. exactly what it sounds yeah. like you guys do. That's SaveLoveGive.com, SaveLoveGive.com. So let me ask you, uh, Mary, what are uh, some of your goals and objectives for 2013? Where are you in those goals? Our goals are... Um include trying to get the message across to the public that um, sudden cardiac arrest is different from a heart attack. A lot of people don't don't understand that um, heart attack can lead to sudden cardiac arrest, but there are many other causes of cardiac arrest, such as underlying um, heart rhythm um, abnormalities. And so we're trying to get the, the word out about that. We're trying to get the word out about the fact that Everybody should know how to save a life, and to um, help save a life, what you need to know is CPR and how to use an automated external defibrillator, and those those devices are increasingly um, prevalent in public places, um, schools, airports, shopping malls, that kind of thing, and we're trying to help educate the public about the fact that, that these devices are safe and effective and really simple to use. You simply open the device um, and listen to the instructions and take it from there. Um, as a result of using those devices before EMS survive, uh, arrives at the scene, survival rates have increased from 10% to 40% in some cases. So, so those are some of the message that, messages uh, that we're working on, and we are trying to get the word out through, uh, through various um, media pieces through our social media efforts, through um, press releases, and and um, by further distribution of our educational campaigns. Okay, very good. How important is a strategic relationship like with Save, Love, and Give to organizations like yours? Well, we are, we are so honored and, and um, excited about this partnership. We we uh, learned about it actually through Susan Copen, who is a uh, TV news anchor in Pittsburgh for KDKA TV, which is a CBS affiliate. Susan um, herself is a survivor of sudden cardiac arrest, and she had interviewed uh, Tom Dumphy from Volodas uh, Save Love Give organization, and um, because of that connection, um, I, I think that's how Todd learned about our organization, and so we consider this to be a great, great uh, gift, and we really have a lot of uh, high regard for the company that seems to have such a strong philanthropic um, focus, which you, you don't see every day, so it's, it's very refreshing and exciting to work with them. Yeah, very good. Thanks so much for being with us. Give that, uh, give that website one more time. It's uh, 3W. SCA-aware.org. Yep, and then you can learn more about uh, what uh, Thomas does. Thomas Pepe, he's a regular contributor on here. You can see why, bringing great cause as well as, uh, I think, great um, entrepreneurial ideas as well with SaveLoveGive.com. That's SaveLoveGive.com. We'll be back with more right after this on The Price of Business. 